What is happening, y'all? Cowboy here, and welcome to Outriders. Now, this is a game that I have been excited to jump into in full for quite a while. I had a chance to play test this all the way back in September. We streamed the beta back in February, had a complete blast with it, uh, decided on Pyromancer as our go-to class, but I have changed up the way I'm going to approach this game. So originally, I was planning on streaming everything uh, with this game, just, you know, all, the entire thing, the story, the multiplayer, all that. Um, but I really want to spend a lot of time kind of playing this with with, with the guys. You know, I haven't had a lot of co-op games lately, uh, and I think this is a really good title that I could jump into with, like, Tox and Greg and Ron and Bobby. Um, so what I want to do is we're going to be doing a Let's Play series covering the story in full, and then all of the multiplayer type shenanigans and the farming and the build crafting. We're going to be doing all that on stream. So I will put those streams in the Let's Play playlist at the appropriate slot so that everything is chronological. Um, and with that in mind, because we already did jump into this game uh, during the demo, I am just going to give you a recap because we've already played it for a bunch. Um, now, I'll have that stream linked for those that want to like watch the whole story. The the download stream is only like 720. So what you're about to see, the, the recap, if you will, a little bit potato on the graphics, but you can watch it in full 1440 by clicking that link. But either way, let's dive into previously on Outriders. Earth was dead. We had destroyed it. Two colony ships were built to carry us across the stars. Only one ship made it. We're all that's left. Listen up, Outriders. I know what you're all thinking. There's no going home. And no one has a clue what's waiting for us out there. Yeah, the water is like floating. Choke on your own spit, dude. It's nothing. I'm good. Jesus. Shit. Get back to the ship. Alert the medics. I'm seeing some really strange shit down here. The fuck. <laughs> Now everyone will die. There's no holding the landing. It's too late for that. Hold the fucking landing! Melt his ass. Too late. What are you doing? I'm putting you back into cryo until Medlab can save your fucking life. Don't be ridiculous. I'm done for. Pep talks aren't really my thing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> shake and bake cutscenes, it's a good way to describe it. I already got caught in the storm, though. Oh, no. Alright, well, the storm has to do something. I thought I was, like, already Pyromancer. Oh, choose your path. Burn! Hold on. 
I've just woken up to mud and shit. I've been asleep for God knows how many years. 31 years. So for 31 years, I've been seeing people fight and die while you were getting comfy in cryo. <laughs> Got it. Cool, man. Kill. We also do not die so easily, do we? Seth. They asked you to help them. To fight the altar down there. Why didn't you? That pathetic monstrosity was a distraction. People are dying because of him. Without the supply route open. They all die. These feeble creatures. Slaughtering each other over scraps. You waste your gifts. So what? I should play at being a god like you. I am not playing. Only one like you could lead them to a future. Why not you? They call him Moloch. I fight another war far above this petty squalor. My war is with the worst of our kind. But this one is too powerful. He will destroy us all. Unless I hunt him down. But this is not your fight. You are to be the shepherd. Find a way for them out of this slaughter. Outrider. Alright, so hopefully that wasn't too long, like I said. Um I tried to I tried to like clip the main important things. So this is right after we had killed that dude. Uh the next quest is speaking with Jacob and leaving the city. Um and kinda, you know, making our way as an outrider. So uh, we are playing Pyromancer, as I said, to kind of give you an idea on our gear and whatnot. Um this this shots regenerate health and then we're we're full blue here. So Things are going to be pretty good. I mean, we obviously upgraded a lot since the, the end of that stream, um, just farming. But we have double thermal bomb, uh, which is dope. And then uh, a buff to overheat, and uh, which I might replace with final breath because I have more health drain efficiency there. But either way, let us jump into it. So where, where am I going? This way. What you see is what you get. Uh, for those curious, we are, of course, playing on PC. This... I mean, I feel bad about that preview because the preview probably looked so potatoey compared to how good the game actually looks. Um, and we are playing PC. Everything is set to ultra. We also have DLSS on on balanced. Um, just personal testing. I had this on performance and I found that it was being a little bit wonky. Uh, so instead, I've put it onto balance and everything seems to be. Uh, I don't know. For whatever reason, on balance, it just works. It works better. So, just something to keep in mind for those of you also playing on PC, but... Um, oh, wait a minute. Is this... So, does this work now? Oh, man. I could go to my other dudes and store stuff. I don't think I have anything, like, worth... No, wait a minute. Wait a minute, I do. I think I do. I'm pretty sure I have, like, some kind of crazy fire shotgun on one of my other guys, but... I don't know. Let's, let's just jump into it. Let's go. I'm not that worried about it. I'll find new weapons. What happened to everyone else? None of the other Outriders survived? Well, you had front row seats for the shit show that started it all. You know, most of us were dead that first day. The few dozen that were left, they did what we came here to do. They fucking explored. I mean, who do you think died trying to figure out we couldn't leave this fucking valley? <laughs> he seems very unhappy. Anyway, to the first city we go. A monument to our downfall. This city was the first human settlement on Enoch. Insurgents and predators now hide in the shadow of the Flora's engine. And again, Dobrowski has outdone himself. Whoa. <laughs> You've managed to keep my truck working after all these years? Looks like they reduced the uh, the shaky well, cam a bit. I stripped the AI systems, bypassed the graphene cells, cost me 20 balls of vodka and parts, but now our baby will run on anything. Diesel, turpentine, even fucking potatoes, if we can grow potatoes. Is 
still got tunes? Tunes? Hey, boss, we got no electronics. No tunes, no nothing. But somehow we make do. The dialogue is so cheesy in this. Like, it's... It's... <laughs> I don't know. It's almost like a... Just like that over the top like Rambo action type flick where it's like everything is like okay like just eye rolling but but you still like it. Might have to knock the cutscenes down. I tried putting the cutscenes to okay, 60 and they the seemed to be in a little bit the uh slums between here and there are infested with snaggle tooth fox and an insurgents that those mutated things are out hunting. What kind of mutated things are we talking about? I'll stick to the roofs, give you some eyes from above. Good luck. Here, cause the game Ooh, God. Are we good now? Yeah, we're good. The nuclear engine from the floor is right. Yeah. The cutscene is the first part I've seen where it's actually gotten a yes, little the anomaly. Lucky. That thing got battered by it until boom, no more energy. Don't tell me you still had people in cryo. Yep. The ETA had a choice. Let them die or wake them up all at once to an unfinished city without food or water. The slums you're looking at, that's where they got exiled to starve and die. Your insurgents call themselves exiles. Be quick. Hmm. The journal. The place is crawling with insurgents. I need to clear them out. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, something's weird. It's not as smooth as it should be. Which might be the, the, uh... Oh god, I'm getting shot. Oh god, I'm getting shot. Oh god, no, 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 stop, stop, stop! Burn! I think it might be the, the actual NVIDIA thing. Because I didn't have that on, um, this wasn't on at all before. Let me disable that. That's weird. The second we turned off the NVIDIA, everything is, uh... Oh, never mind. I think I spoke too soon. Did I reach that? Nope. Pistol. No mess to thickness.
back up a little bit. the pistol. in my ass. This shit is gonna take some getting used to. I guess because I'm, uh... Because I'm already basically immortal, so it's not like a storm is concerned. Supposed to No, do I not go up? Yeah, no, it wants me to go up. That's weird. It wouldn't let me go up just a second ago. Solar panels. It's like a whole solar city. The bomb go off. There we go.
What's this other guy at? Do not like dying. No! Bro, I just hit him with the flamethrower. Damn. I might need to swap out my uh my one skill. Hey Outrider. Is it true you from Earth? Oh well, nothing like you imagine. My generation. We lived our whole lives knowing Earth was over. We killed to survive. To earn our seed on the Flores. We got a few happy memories, but Fourteen to they were much the better range than the range and the burn. I might need to do feed the flames here instead of heat wave. He's afflicted with burn. Yeah, let's do that. Because the thing is, I need I need a way to consistently heal. And like, you, you heal via damage, but... CC is this just helps too much to not have. subordinate. No! Again, bro? Oh my god. This captain is going to be the death of me. Even pick up. I don't remember having a burst rifle. 
Oh, I guess it's always been burst. <laughs> Did I, like change the fire? Part of the problem is the game, I have the, the world stayed up really high. Because it gets some better loot. But along with that, um, everybody gets quite tanky. Which won't be a problem once I get my skills leveled up a little bit more. I also think I'll be fine if I can just push this asshole. smarter about using my cover. Ah, this guy does not want to die. Holy shit, he's down.
There we go. And I love the two for one specials. an insane battle. I might I might have to turn down my world tier. So we go that way. So what's up here? Enter historian inspiration area, so we got a side quest or something here. Let's see. Start tracking new quest historian inspiration. Oh, for the guy, there's something the historian would want me to collect for him. Oh, we can do this real fast over here. It's just go, go, go. Oh, oh shit. No, 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 no. Come on, get out of the way. I uh, can't get out. Oh, fucking let me go. Oh my god, that's so stupid. I'm all the way back at the start. Alright. If that's how these dudes are gonna play, we're about to hit them with the big, the big boom. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh god. We got big chungus over here. Go, go, bomb! Let's fucking go, baby! That's how we do it! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I just took so much damage. Nope, gotta go. God damn, flamethrower guys, not mess around at all.
See, but shit like that, though, that's, that's exactly why I like Pyro so much. Is being able to group up an entire just... Oh, there's like 30 of you. Yeah, let's just go. Let's do it. It's auto vacuum, by the way. Okay, someone's wondering why I'm not picking up the loot. Die! It's literally a spawn point. Get the hell out of here! Volcanic rounds. That sounds yummy. Volcanic rounds. So my rounds light enemies on fire? I'll have to take a look at that. Unknown area. Okay. I think I got the, the quest done that I came here for. But so we're going to keep, since this is a, uh, you know, episode one, we're going a little bit longer. Make it, like, closer to an hour. No, I think that's what I, I think there was an item down there. Um, how do I get over there? Let's see. I have to go, I did, I see. I see, I see. Man, just running through it and then being like, fuck it, and just blowing up everybody, that was... Ooh, that was satisfying. Especially because I they, they just, they gang rushed me, dude. Like, I got stuck and there was nothing I could do. I was like, it's bullshit. And then, man, talk about a comeback. That was beautiful. Status consumed by this skill increases your resistance. Yeah, how about the explosion radius? This skill can be activated one more time. Health drain efficiency, double. I like double heat wave. Mm, double thermal bomb is nice, but weakness on heat wave could be good too. I think I'll keep what I have though. Two of those and two thermal bombs. Some writing here. Contact. Let's go. Speed. Violence. That's uh, I gotta I gotta play this game like it's Doom. A lot of them aren't even there and coming for me.
I'm liking that radius. Time to go again. I think Thermal Bomb might be my favorite ability just because it pops people out of cover. Last guy had the key. Which, let me look at that new skill I got. So if it's just fire bullets, I'm kind of like, eh. It fills your current weapons magazine with bullets that ignite the air around enemies and flick burn even if the bullet misses. When the bullet hits, it causes skill damage, ignoring armor and piercing the target, damaging others behind them. Go last until you reload or switch weapons. And it's a 23 second cooldown. I don't know if I'd do that. If I was running... Like, if I had, like, a light machine gun, something that was, like, a really big clip. Maybe, but... Yeah, I don't know. I see the radio tower. No sign of Zahidi. They're probably keeping him in one of the buildings close to the tower. <sighs> Judging by the number of insurgents heading your way. I'm guessing they know we're here. That's always nice to hear. Awfully quiet here. some decent looking auto loot though there. What's oh, a big boy automatic shotgun? <laughs> okay, let's go. This thing's goofy as hell. Goodness.
Oh. Yeah, I might need to just turn down the- oh shit! I didn't see the one sneaking up on me. I might- something like this though, I might need to turn down World Tendency. Like the open up right here, you know, the start of this. So that's it. He's trying to vortex me. He's that thing. All right, I need to. Living bomb saving my ass. Fuck off. I'm liking this, this shotgun sniper combo seems to work pretty well. Pop out the, uh, the sniper for anything that's long range to get damage and then once they get close enough they can't do much, just pop 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 wonder if this is gonna actually end with like a fight, or? Get back! I'll kill him! Calm down! Not a step closer, I swear! Rip him open! Get back! This man's gonna bleed out. Who are you? Shira Gutman sent me to find you. Thought you might want to see this. That's a frequency. What the? Where did you get? Where? Jane! You're hurt! It's nothing, Doc. Tell me the briefcase is safe. No, the truck is gone. I... Oh, the fuck. Wait, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, 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 listen to me, listen to me. I might be able to stop the bleeding, but you have to tell me where your people took my truck. I will save your life. Promise? Yes. Go down past river. All right, Doc, move back. Wait, no, 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 I just gave this man my word. We can't leave him alive, he knows too much. No, he doesn't have to die. We already have what we want. <laughs> Oh shit! James! No! Get her up. I'm taking her back to my truck. No! You have to find the doc's truck. Oh my it's more God. important than me. You have no idea. There's a briefcase under the oil tank. Bring it back safe. Got one all Gordon Freeman at the end there. Just yeeted that dude. <laughs> what the freaking? Hold on, Jane. Hold on. Oh my god. Stay with me, okay, Jane? You stay with me. Damn it. Go, Outrider. Go! Well, that seems like a good spot to, to wrap things up with that mission being done. 
Um, but anyway, let's take a look because we got a new point and some new gear. Um, so I need to mantle, mantle. Heat wave inflicts weakness. Thermal bomb explosion damage increased. Oh man. Uh, double thermal bomb or explosion increase? I think. Oh, well, oh man, no, the level difference though, that's big. I might have to take this. Even though I was like, well, I don't know. Like that's, these are only like level nine. The mats. Yeah, those, this, the level 12. That's a big increase to my armor. And with the way I'm playing, I'm gonna need to do that. All right, what is this? Shots on enemies afflicted by status condition inflicted on the nearest enemy. Okay. Uh, is that my prolif? No, that's my essence proliferation. But then I really like the auto shotty. So I wonder, could I like thermal bomb and then spread thermal bomb and then spread it to other enemies? Because if so, that's going to be good. Activating explosive skills increases your weapon damage by 35%. Uh, that seems like a clear, clear winner here. Explosive skills. And thermal bomb is considered explosive. Heats, ignite, mobilize. Overheat is also explosive. Um... Do I go for overheat instead of the heal? Yeah, I think I pull overheat back out. And if I'm struggling to keep alive, we'll go back. I can't wait till I get the other stuff. Like this thing looks like a freaking ray of sun coming down. So anyway, we're gonna wrap things up here. Um, more than likely the episodes are, I'm, I'm gonna keep these a little bit longer, I think. Just, you know, however long it takes to get through missions. Uh, but either way, that's gonna be it for now. I'll have another part probably coming your way later today since, you know, we are kind of celebrating launch, kicking it on and off. Uh, but stay tuned and I'll catch y'all soon enough with some more Outriders.